Hey, I'm Super Fizz. Uh, it is going to be August 23rd, 2020, uh, a little bit past my bedtime, but I wanted to kind of share something that's interesting to me. Uh, I'm going to switch to screen share mode. Uh, and what I want to share tonight, okay, I'm a little out of practice, so forgive me, um, is that's actually a couple things. It's going to be the new POAP checkout alpha, and it's going to be um, a game that I played where um, I used POAP checkout to uh, give a POAP to people who celebrated Nixora Kish's contributions. She hosted a community call for East Decker the other night. It went the other day. It went really well, um, and I was really happy to see her stepping up to the plate. Um, and the thing that I'm always talking about on Twitter, which is our need to give back to people who hold POAPs, uh, and so. At some level, a POAP is a memory, but on another level, especially when it comes to things like the uh, Genesis Depositor POAPs, um, I really feel like the community has an opportunity to kind of reward these early adopters with airdrops or whatever. And so what I wanna do is do a quick demo of this. Um, I'll start at the beginning, should take about 10 minutes. And so it begins with um, Nick Sorakish did this. Um, she's actually done a great job. She started in East Acre, has been very welcoming um, and knowledgeable and really supportive of what I believe is the core uh, East Acre ethos. Um, and so I kind of wanted to celebrate that and use POAP Checkout and play a game. Uh, and of course, if I'm playing a game, I don't really tell you in advance, but I posted this opportunity to pay 0 0.01 ETH for this uh, POAP on, um, what's it called? Uh, the new POAP checkout app. And uh, if you check this now, this is actually gonna probably be open for a month after this video, but I won't be um, won't be playing the game as then I will not send anyone else value who participates. Um, and I mean that pretty sincerely, this is not an extension of the game. Uh, everyone had 24 hours and and I'm done. But if you do want to celebrate Nick Sorkish, then I would encourage you to check this out. Um, and so I'm going to go to MetaMask um, and connect. Uh, and so Superfizz, I already bought this POAP. I already have it. Um, where I'm going to talk a little bit more about POAP Checkout. Um, it is a, a site developed by Mentor. And essentially, you can um, sell a POAP. Uh, and there's it's, it's that easy. Like you go to, you set it up on app.pop, you'll set it up here as usual. And I actually have another video of what it looks like to set this up. Um, but you would go to the back end and you would create a new PO app. Um, and then you would carry those details after it's, after it's uh, uh, curated to here and you would, um, you would essentially create a cell for, and then you would share that link and people would come to this link and they would use whatever 0 0.01 ether with 0 0.01 ETH. Um, and they would buy your POAP and it would be, and it would be delivered. Um, and so the next thing I want to talk about though, is like giving value back to those POAPs. And it is uh, something that's really important to me that POAPs, if you're giving POAPs out, you need to give your POAPs value. Um, now, maybe in some cases, the value of the POAP is simply the event. That's great. But sometimes the value of the POAP is in possessing it. Like a Genesis Depositor POAP, yes, people are proud of those, but they're also community contributors, and they're people that should be on every airdrop list. And I want to show you how easy it is for anyone to give value to a POAP holder. And so I'm just going to search for Nixorkish here, and it should pop up. Here's the one. 18 people paid 0 0.01 ETH for that POAP, and... Uh, I haven't actually done this on the setup, uh, but I'm going to try. Uh, J.M. Luther got in like right under uh, the bar. Good job, J.M. Luther. Uh, and so that is going to be a CSV file that is going to open. Let me copy that in to a Google spreadsheet. Let's see what this looks like. Let's paste unformatted. Let's try it this way. Hey, hey okay. Uh, probably going to have to, uh, in most cases, you won't have to do this, but, well, let me see if I can do it. 
Okay. Um, normally you would do an import. I think I can do an import. The reason I didn't is because this is, um, I'm trying not to dox myself. Like I, it's hard for me to find a clean desktop where I can just sort of like um, do goofy things. And yeah, see like on this, I'm still getting all of these crazy, um, crazy documents that I didn't intend to share. Um, all right, so I can import that and it should come in without the quotes and yeah. So this is really, it's very simple. So I have a, an export from POAF Gallery. I exported the CSV. I imported it into Google Sheets. Um, and uh, here I have it. And on this page, I'm just going to remove some data that I do not need for um, uh, for POAF, I'm sorry, for the dispersed delivery. What I want to do, I want to send these people back value. Um, what happened is people who wanted this POEP were willing to pay 0.01 ETH. Basically, they were willing to participate in something that I asked them to participate in without knowing that there would be a reward. And um, they played my game, so I want to reward them back. I think I need to maybe save this as something like... <laughs> so a lot of this is a lot of this is looking goofy because I'm... Uh, doing it live without my normal tools, but you can really see how to, um, you can see how to modify this just by cutting out the extra fields just to get the addresses. And I want to give each of those people 0 0.025 back after they gave um, 0 0.01. So basically they two and a half X by um, buying this POAP up for Nix Orkish. And it gives me the opportunity to um, kind of play this game. Now I want to go to disperse, uh, disperse.app. And these are the, the POAP holders that I want to reward. This is how much I plan to give them. And disperse.app is an app that lets me um, disperse. So it's going to let, you'll see, it's, it's going to let me send uh, a bulk transaction to all of these wallets. And I'm going to send Ether. You can send uh, tokens as well. And here I'm just going to paste. Okay, that's the wrong paste though. I need to get this data. Let's also do the control C. It's got to get in the buffer somehow. Okay. And that should work. It's pretty smart. It, it accepts any format and it sees all of these addresses. One of them is me. I'm sending 0 0.025 ETH to, um, and it's a total of about a half ETH. And uh, yeah, that's the fun. And so what I'm demonstrating here is the ability to reward POAP holders with Ether. And so I'm going to go here and confirm that. Got to click it fast before I think twice. I love to be generous, but that doesn't always make it easy. Um, and so that transaction is pending. And when this completes, uh, each of those addresses will receive 0 0.025. Um, and so essentially, as a POAP issuer, I gave value back to the people who um, claimed that POAP. Now, maybe I'm not the issuer. Maybe I'm a member of the community and I, I want to go find a POAP um, like that I want to reward. I really encourage um, people to reward the ETH Staker Challenge coin. Like you can find these ETH Staker Challenge coins and you can uh, reward those holders or maybe the Kiln Testnet. Um, that was a very difficult to get... Uh, Oh, uh, that was, that's the viewer. I'm looking for the participant. Ah, this one. Uh, you had to actually participate in the kiln test net and propose a block. So really, I just encourage you to go and look for um, these projects where people have really committed a lot of their time and effort. Um, download the CSV from POAP Gallery. Take it to disperse.app. Um, give those people a little bit of value. It really is a way of uh, rewarding people who have contributed to the ecosystem.
All right, uh, that's it. Uh, I hope that was useful to you and have a great day. Let me see how to stop this. Bye-bye. Still here. <laughs>